What is unsupervised learning? Geek is for geeks have the answer. Unsupervised learning is the training of a machine using information that is neither classified nor labeled and allowing the algorithm to act on that information without guidance. Here, the task of machine is to group unsorted information according to similarities, patterns, and differences without any prior training of data. Unlike supervised learning, no teacher is provided. That means no training will be given to the machine. Therefore, the machine is restricted to find the hidden structure in unlabeled data by itself. For instance, suppose it's given an image having both dogs and cats, which it has never seen. The machine has no idea about the features of dogs and cats, so we can't categorize it as dogs and cats, but it categorizes them according to their similarities patterns and differences. We can easily categorize the picture into two parts. The first may contain all pictures having dogs in them and the second part might contain all pictures having cats in them. Tech target is explaining the objective of unsupervised learning. The objective with unsupervised learning is to have the algorithms identify patterns within the training data sets and categorize the input objects based on the patterns that the system itself identifies. The algorithms analyze the underlying structure of the data sets by extracting useful information or features from them. The most important algorithms of unsupervised learning are clustering, association rule, anomaly detection, dimensionality reduction. Clustering. Clustering is the method of dividing the objects into clusters that are similar between them and are dissimilar to the objects belonging to the another cluster. For example, finding out which customer is made a similar product purchases. Suppose a telecom company wants to reduce its customer's churn rate by providing personalized call and data plans. The behavior of the customers is studied and the model segments the customers with similar traits. Several strategies are adopted to minimize churn rate and maximize profit through suitable promotion and campaigns. On the right side of the image, you can see a graph where customers are grouped. Group A customers use more data and also have high call duration. Group B customers are heavy internet users, while Group C customers have high call duration. So Group B will be given more data benefit plans, while Group C will be given cheaper call it call rate planners and group A will be given the benefit of both. Association rule. Association is a rule-based machine learning to discover the probability of occurrence of items in a collection. For example, finding out which products were purchased together. Let's say that a customer goes to a supermarket and buys bread, milk, fruit, and wheat. Another customer comes and buys bread, milk, rice, and butter. Now, when another customer comes, it's highly likely that if he buys bread, he will buy milk too. Hence, a relationship is established based on customer behavior and recommendations are made. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed, please subscribe, comment, and share as we will talk about anomaly detection and dimensionality detection in our next tutorial videos.